almost locked you out. Oh, that wouldn't have been a first. Oh, <laughs> oh the oh, humanity of it all. Yeah. Wow. He's mean to me, sis. Mm, I'm trying to treat you like a queen. How are you? Yeah. Well, yeah, the guys came back over this morning, wrapped up some final cosmetic stuff, and yeah, in and out in about an hour, charged up the uh, compressor or the condenser on the side of the house. Everything this is complete. Job is done. They even got on the roof. I found uh, my little vent, little vent pipe there, right above the window. Uh, wasn't sealed real well, so they put some tape around it to kind of patch it till I get the roof done, maybe in a few years. And they went up to the top where the vent is to put some black tar sealing around it, so there's no leaks. But uh, yeah, this job is complete. And the guy, actually, uh, he's not maybe a couple years older than me. He's got similar foot issues because I think I re-aggravated my toe helping them out. I knocked about $500 off of uh, the bill this time. So total, I think I knocked off around $1,000. So, oh, did you? Yeah. I mean, I paid 2000 for the ventilation, 4000 for the equipment and install. So... I'm pretty happy and it works very well. Yeah, heat works great. Air conditioning definitely is pretty cold, but of course it's you know cool outside already, so you really can't tell. But yeah, I'm looking forward to testing it out in our hot summers here in the Carolinas. But yeah, anyway, the guy said he recommended some type of a topical cream, and I gave it to my girl to check out. And yeah, apparently Walmart has it, so we're gonna go to Walmart and see if they do. We'll pick up a tube of it. For my toe, see if that'll give it some instant relief because I'm still taking, you know, my supplements and all that. But you know, it's it just I don't know it it minimizes the pain, but it's still there. And I know I can't keep going back and forth on those steroids because that's not good for me. So yeah, I'm gonna try something a little different and hope that uh, this will you know kind of keep my toe issue under control, especially with the upcoming vacation. So. Yep, new tires are on the van, too, so I keep my girl safe. I'm safe, Sebs. Yeah. <laughs> so, projects galore are getting done, and there'll be time for a break here in a couple of days, so. Guess what he did, Sebs? I'm spilling more pee. Oh, are you? Yeah. Now, there's three men. Well, three men, Sebs. Three men. And they couldn't find the paperwork to register the equipment in there. Oh, the key, yeah, the, the, the instruction manuals and... Yeah. yeah. So, I, of course, ladies, you know how it is, you know, when you're having work done. So, I had to come yesterday and come over and, you know, tear up the kitchen and, and clean it. You know, only thing I didn't do was the floor because I knew the guys were coming back today. But everything else was stripped and cleaned, scrubbed. Cabinets, you know, countertops, everything was done. And... You know, I go on about my business. In the dining room, all I did was vacuum. That was it. Because they were coming back. So I couldn't even pull up the rugs or whatever, you know, to wash them. I'll do that when we get back. Then I wandered on. I didn't even do the living room. You know, I just, I mostly wanted to get the kitchen done. Because, they, you know, stuff was flying all over the place. And I, that's where the food is and that's where I cook. You know, so I want, I want to keep that clean. So I'm over there, you know, minding my own business, doing a little research. So... I get a call, Sibs. Um, when you were cleaning, did you see the paperwork? They don't know what they did with the paperwork, Sibs. They have no idea what they did with it. Last time I saw it, it was up in the attic on top of the unit. I saw the two packets up there, and I, I'm assuming they got them, you know, they brought them down. But they must have taken them with them because we can't find them. But I just happened to ask her just in case maybe she saw them no. or whatever. Because uh, I, it, well, I wasn't accusing you of I, anything. I, when did I say that? I well, didn't say that. I said between the three of them, they don't know what happened. I've yeah. got, I've got the paperwork or the website and the the labels. That's the important thing, apparently. But he said he'd get me the paperwork later on for the other two units up in the attic. But yeah, so we've got uh, paperwork for the com the condenser, which I've got, then the furnace, and then the AC. Um, I guess it's the I guess it's part of the, the ventilation system up there in the attic. So there's three sets of yeah. you know pieces of paperwork and all. Back to the story. Sir. Oh. 
So anyway, so, you know, yeah, I, I tore up the kitchen because you know why? There was nothing in there. So, and he said, well, when you clean the dining room, what did I just say I did in the dining room, subs? I said I vacuumed. That was it. I didn't dust. I didn't move anything. I didn't mop. None of that. I just vacuumed. That's that's all I did. Well, um, did you move anything on the table? What did I just say I did, subs? What did I just say I did? No. Three men. None of them could figure out what happened. But it was that pesky wife. Cleaning. You, you, that, you done it. With that pesky cleaning. <laughs> trying to keep everything clean and, and presentable. Damn it. We can't have that. No. We got to have stuff dirty. Laying around. Laying around. So I can find it. Uh. Damn that good housekeeper. <laughs> what was she thinking? Damn it. And nope. all because of that dusting and sweeping and mopping. Note to self, don't call wife if something is missing. Yeah. <laughs> and I don't know nothing about I wasn't there, so when they were doing all of this here, I stayed over at the mega shit. I I mean yesterday I was over at the house, but I just shut the bedroom door because you know what I was doing, subs. So I cleaned the, his bathroom and the bedroom. And that was it, except when the guys left in I got I got the kitchen and scrubbed all that down because it uh, it was a mess. But I have I have no idea because I would have if I'd have had the paper I would have picked it up and said do you need what is this you know but you know why I didn't say that subs because there wasn't any. I'm thinking the guys upstairs brought it down and they took it with them by accident and it may have gotten tossed. It may have just fell. Yeah, I looked up there in the attic. I couldn't find it. So, well, but well, now the well. labels they they did save the labels and that's what I need to do to go online and register it. So that's the important thing to get the registration you know going. So I can get my warranties and guarantees and, and keep my girl in, in a nice warm house in the winter and a nice cool house in the summer. Yeah. Well, I know when I got my furnace put in, subs, I had um, the warranty was for 10 years. Yeah, mine's a 10 year. On the parts. Yeah. You know, so, and it, I think it covered, for the labor, I think it was five years, but the parts were 10 years. So, mm -hmm. you know, yeah, but they, the, um, what happened with my warranty and all was that in Pittsburgh, it's called Tootie. They did all the paperwork. They filled everything out and sent me the copies. I didn't have mm -hmm. to do anything. They did. They registered everything and sent me the paperwork back. Well. Yep. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm handling all this myself because I'm sponsible. <laughs> He thought I moved that stuff, since. I didn't and know I, she and saw I, it. And I hadn't seen it at all. Yeah. I mean, I, I mm -mm. Yeah. It's probably down here somewhere, yeah. but where, I, I don't know, because I wasn't here, you know, yeah. when this was going on. No, I really, I don't think I've seen it. I, they may have, when they cleaned up yesterday, I think they hauled everything out and took it with them. They may have dumped it by accident. That's my more guess. Than, more than likely. So, I looked up in the attic. I looked all around the unit, looked on the stuff I have in the attic. No, it would it would have stood out, and it's not there, so and no big deal. I'll just register it. But anyway, we've been talking for oh wow, we're going on uh, nine minutes, so uh, we're gonna go get some topical cream for my toe because it's bothering me again. So enjoy the road trip. <laughs> I love you. Uh -huh. <laughs> I was accused of this. Oh, sorry.
whole tank at $26. Great, thank you very much. You got your bag or you want to bring a bag? Oh. Okay.
frozen cereal, some sugar. Oh, you found some soap and some jello. Yeah. Still sitting there for ninety dollars. Oh, it was ninety nine. Now it's ninety. Oh, oh big drop. Uh -huh. some mac and cheese, but I don't see any discount price on it. So I must have just set them there. Mm -hmm. Alright. I'll go ahead and get this few things, then we'll just order the that topical cream then. Okay. So that cream, apparently that's something you have to order online only from Walmart. They don't have it in stock. Thanks. I don't even see the name. Yeah. I don't see anything with Pete. So thanks to my girl for asking the pharmacist. So we'll just get it from Amazon. I'll order it when we get home. Yeah, and it'll be here tomorrow. So cool. Just for vacation. So we're going to go home. Yeah. Woo.
this venture quick to and fro to Walmart. So until next time, adios.